Hi everybody. Um, I had to do another video today because I'm really excited about this soup that I had. You know, I wasn't that much into gazpacho soup. You know, years ago when I was in LA, I heard about it. You know, it was all the rave. Um, and I went to Barcelona. I had a cold soup there, but I liked it, but it wasn't my thing. I was like, wow, it's all raw and it's cold. But I had this at this Gratitude Cafe in Munich uh, three weeks ago, and I've been making it almost every day. And I have to tell you the amazing effects it had on me. I wasn't thinking about food all the time because I was satiated, satisfied, and fulfilled. My I felt nutritionally fulfilled. And I wasn't always grazing and I was thinking about food because I'm always thinking about food because I love food. So I've been going to make a variation of it today. Um, I feel like may, warming up a little bit because it's really cold. But I'll tell you what I'm going to put in it. I'm not making a traditional gazpacho soup. The base is the same, tomatoes, and I'm going to put in avocado, parsley, sea salt, and things like that. But I added, I already put this stuff in here. I have organic tomatoes, avocado, zucchini. For some reason, I feel like having zucchini. Warm zucchini soup. And uh, these, what they're called, um, pointy bell peppers. They're a little bit sweeter than the normal bell peppers. And they're delicious. So, I'm going to put it in a blender. Right? And I juiced um, bok choy and carrot stalk, carrots, a little bit of orange. I'm going to put that in as the base a little bit. And then I'm going to add some uh, filtered water. So I'll put that in there. God, isn't that, that is just gorgeous. I love it. Um, and then after I warm it up just a little bit in a pan, I'm going to roast some um, pumpkin seeds. Great, great for some omega-3 and some fiber. I might add a little bit of oil. You know, women need a little bit more oil. I have French sea salt. I'm just digging the French sea salt. I tried the Himalayan salt. That doesn't somehow work for me. I was putting it in, in, in some of my dishes, raw dishes. But I had a sort of a weird feeling like I felt salty, you know, for some reason. When I put French gray salt in my dishes, I feel energetic. I just, these are handcrafted in France and actually they're cheaper than the Himalayan salt. I got a huge bag for about five or six dollars. And they go a long way. They're like really crunchy. Although they're a little bit, the pieces are pretty big, but you don't feel like really salty. This is just enhances everything. And the cracked pepper, and you could even probably add a little bit of soy sauce, but let's try it. So I'm gonna, I added the juice. I might not need too much, I'm just gonna put a little bit more water so that you know it grinds. Uh, I like my soup a little bit spicy, so I'm gonna add a little bit of, um, of this chili pepper, right? I've been really craving spicy food or citrusy I think my body is wanting to detox I think when you crave really spicy things and um, especially like lemon I've been drinking a lot of lemon water uh, with honey um, I think my body just wants to detox I think it's ready so I'm going to put that in uh, let's see what it looks like so Let's do it. I just have to smile when I make this soup. This soup makes me smile, you know? Oh. And then after I warm it up a little bit, actually it tastes really amazing cold too, but my body's saying I want a little bit warm and then you can put some, some lemon juice on it and then a little bit of sprig of parsley. So I'll tell you, 
Now how I'm going to put it, I have a cute little bowl. You know, this retains the heat. Or sometimes, you know what, I take a little teacup like that and just put it in here and have a shot. You know, why not? So, um, I'm going to taste it first. And then um, add the salt and the pepper. It's amazing what a blender can do. Look, it's already, it's already soupy. Wow, it's great. The, the spiciness is there. You can taste all the vegetables. I didn't even put salt or pepper in it. It tastes amazing. To bring out a little more flavor. Wow, that's great. Mm, I'm, I think I might eat it cold. So, it's so good. So I just put two or three pinches depending on how much vegetables I've had in there. And I have these organic um, three different colors of pepper. Yeah. Um, I was going to put soy sauce in, but I don't think I'm going to. I'm going to blend it just a little bit more so that the peppers and the salt get in there. And then I wait a few, like maybe five, ten minutes so all the, all the, you know, the symphonic vitamin mixture can happen and it's just amazing. I'm going to have this for breakfast. I have like raw foods for breakfast and people are like, oh my God, are you crazy? But I don't care. I feel great. I mean, I have so much energy. I feel like I'm high. I go to class to teach my class and my students are like staring at me like, oh my God, she's glowing. So anyway, uh, bon appetit and see you soon. Bye.